factor plus one, this is equal to zero. So this means that lambda square is equal to minus one. Uh, immediately, we can say that lambda one is equal to i, and uh, lambda two is equal to minus i. Okay, so these are two eigenvalues which are uh, which are complex values. Meanwhile, it is very important for us also as a, as a practice to look where are these numbers in the complex plane. So here we have the real part of the complex numbers. This is the imaginary part of the complex numbers, which we denote them with a Z. And I is right here. Minus I is right here. So I, we find it rotated by an angle of 90 degree this way. This is minus 90 degree this way which means that this is equal to e to the power i 90, okay? And this is equal to e to the power i minus 90, okay? These are the eigenvalues. Now, we could not have done this discussion. This is not very essential, but immediately, let's see what could be the eigenvectors. Uh, the eigenvectors, we move, we do the same trick. So we do here a minus lambda i, and here we assume when lambda is equal to i, okay? And then we substitute the following, we say, uh, when this is i, or actually we can substitute it from here. This is minus i minus one, one minus i, okay? So what is this? This is the following. This is a minus lambda i times the vector x. This is equal to zero, right? We remember this. This is a, b, this is equal to zero, zero. And then we ask the same question, which is the following. What is the rank of this matrix? It should be one because the uh, determinant here should be equal to zero. And let's check. This is minus one plus one, zero. That is true. So if the rank here is equal to one, we need only one equation. What is this equation? Can somebody read this for me? Minus i a minus b, this is zero. Okay. This is one equation that we can obtain from here which means that this is minus i a, this is equal to b. Then what is a b? a b in this case would be equal to what? Let's set b or let's set a one. If a is one, what is b? Minus i, done. This is the first eigenvector, okay? Because this is satisfied, one times minus i, got, did it, okay? So this is the first eigenvector. The other eigenvector is, is the following. We have to substitute for minus i. If we substitute the minus i, this becomes, let's see the system here. This is minus minus i. This is i minus one. This is one i, I believe. Yes, this is correct. And here we have a times b. This should be, so please don't forget, we have this. This is equal to zero, zero. And then we have only one equation because the rank should be equal to zero. Sorry, rank should be equal to one. Then here we get a, sorry, a i minus b, this is zero. Then a and b, they are equal to, let's set uh, a equal to one. If we set a equal to one, then b is equal to i. Okay, we got this. Yes, so these are the two eigenvalues and these are the two eigenvectors. Any question? Uh, any other things that we can discuss here? Okay, we found the eigenvalues. Now, to find the eigenvectors, it's good to, mm -hmm. to look at, at this problem in this way. We can do the following. Uh, this is a two by two matrix, okay? Now, this is a completely different way how to find it, which is easy, in fact. But let's think for the, the following. Lambda 1 plus lambda 2. What is lambda 1 plus lambda 2? So this should be equal to the trace of the matrix A. What is the trace? This is 0. Okay. Then what is the... That, that's correct, Faldi. Thank you, Faldi, for confirming this. The, the trace is the summation of these two terms. So this is the, the trace. This is 0. And then the other question is, uh, what is lambda 1 times lambda 2? This should be equal to the determinant, right? So that's good. Okay, thanks, Fali. What is the value of this determinant? Zero minus minus one should be equal to one. Okay, wait a second. Is this correct? I think this is uh, correct. So from here, we can get the set of two, uh, two unknowns, two equations. We can find lambda one and lambda two from here also. Okay. Now, can we give you another two by two matrix? 
which is not as simple as this one. Uh, you couldn't find one from, from the lecture notes? Okay. 